Peruvian food has two sides, the heartier version and the lighter side. This is Living Local, Traveling Global with Kelly Farrow, featuring United States Tour Operators Association member Travcoa in Peru. Peru's delicious reputation as a foodie destination is not in vain. After my experience, I can safely say that Peruvian food deserves all of its praise. Peru is known as the culinary capital of South America, and the Peruvians love their food. And that's why we're starting here at the local Cerquillo Market in Lima, the fresh equivalent of the grocery store. I think the country's deliciousness all starts from its abundance of natural Peruvian crops and products. So this is a very typical Peruvian fruit called lucuma, and it's different than anything I've ever had because it's super dry inside. It doesn't look that appealing, but it tastes delicious. It's really sweet. It tastes like butterscotch. I always love to visit local markets because you get to see where the locals actually shop, and it's a colorful insight into the country's personality. You basically get a crash course in their food attitude. Plus, you get to taste a lot of the local treats, too. And a very historical fruit is the pacay. It looks like a long bean pod, and inside there's these fuzzy little white seeds. You peel off the white, and you just eat that part, not the seed. And this was enjoyed by the pre-Incas, so this has been around for a long time. With so many delicious fruits, Lima locals have jumped on the fruit craze. And that's why popular juice places like here at La Gran Fruta are popping up all over the city. All of these juices are made from fruits that we just tried at the market, and now they're made even better because they're blended up together in beautiful looking juices. I tried each one and I can't tell you which one I like the best. On your way to the Nazca Lines from Lima, you have to stop halfway right here at El Peloto. It's a family run restaurant, the mom is actually in the kitchen, it's extremely clean and the food is great. And my favorite salty snack is cancha. They're corn kernels roasted in salt and oil and they're delicious. They go down easy. You can try all the different local specialties and you'll see that it's packed with locals as well and I would suggest the Camarones with avocado because it's delicious. Ceviche is a very typical dish here in Lima and it makes a lot of sense because we're located right on the sea. So the fish is very, very fresh. And here at this restaurant, Miguel is teaching me how to make their spin on ceviche. It's not exactly typical, but it's their own customized way. I feel like I'm gonna chop my finger off. <laughs> This is the final product. We have a beautiful dish of ceviche, courtesy of Senoria del Suco. Mmm, that is delicious. <laughs> Gracias. <laughs> As you may know, pisco sours are the drink here in Peru, and they're made with only five ingredients. Pisco, of course, limes, sugar, egg whites, and bitters. Pisco Sour was originally created in a hotel right here in downtown Lima by a bartender who was swapping Pisco for whiskey in a whiskey sour. Now you know when you order one here where it came from. Jin Jin. Salud. 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 When you travel, the highlights of the day often revolve around food. And in Lima, that's certainly no exception. I love all of Lima's street vendors, especially the popcorn, sweet and salty. If you see that, definitely get some. Ceviche is on almost every menu, and I ordered it pretty much every time. But another popular dish is lomo saltado, which is evidence of the Chinese influence in Peruvian cuisine. It's steak and vegetables stir-fried in soy sauce, with a healthy helping of french fries. Just the happiest fusion. And now we're out here in the Peruvian countryside to try a typical Sunday lunch in a beautiful hacienda. A very typical drink here in Peru is called chicha morada, which means purple corn. It's made at home, usually by hand, with lime juice, cinnamon sticks, and boiled purple corn, plus some sugar, and it tastes pretty interesting, has a very light flavor, but I was looking around and everyone here is drinking it. It's pretty refreshing on a hot day. As I mentioned, Peruvians love to eat, and they like their food rich, salty, spicy, and sweet. Your taste buds better get ready if you want to eat like a local in this country.